I'm here in a greenhouse surrounded by numerous turf grass species, many of them we'll be talking about in this class. I'm using this as a backdrop to mention two terms that you'll come across in this class. One term called variety and the other one called a bar, which often are used interchangeably. And these terms are really a subset of a species. Uh, for example, Synanon dactylon or Bermuda grass, if we stick variety, B-A-R, after the species name and say dactylon, that means common Bermuda grass. And that's been a natural selection. In other words, that occurs in nature uh, naturally. Um, the other types, mainly all the cool season grasses, when we talk about cultivars, and to a large extent, the warm season cultivars, are actually, the word cultivar is short for the word cultivated variety. And what that means is there's been some human intervention into the production or the process of, of developing that subspecies. For example, Kentucky bluegrass, the cultivar Marion. Kentucky bluegrass, the species name is Poa pretensis. Marion would be designated as CV, short for cultivated variety, Marion. Or oftentimes it's also designated as having Marion, for example, in parentheses, single parentheses. Again, cultivar and variety are used interchangeably. And you'll see that in the following uh, presentation by Darren Davis, Tiff Grand of Bermuda grass. You'll hear it referred to as a variety. You see that most often on warm season grasses. Variety and cultivar are used uh, with a lot more interchangeability than, for example, on cool season grasses where we use cultivar uh, most often. And again, differences a variety is natural occurring and often breed true to type and cultivars or cultivated varieties have human interference in how they cross up or select for them.